is going to do is split the brain up. So we're going to be looking at moving one side of the body and the other together. This is not going to be easy, but it's something that I'd like you to go back and practice. Maybe it's something that might take you a couple of weeks, might take you months, you might get it straight away, but it's really going to connect your brain to work in different directions um, at the same time. All right, so you're using multiple parts of the brain. So we're going to start by taking our hands to the side. One, that's the first move, okay? So we're going to have our right hand across and our left hand to the side. One, okay? This is the part where we're going to split the brain into two. So our right hand is going to collapse at the same time our left hand is going to come in. We're going to make like half of a box, okay? Two moves. There's eight moves all together. So you're going to go one, two, good, one more time, and one, two, good. From this point again, also splitting the brain into two parts where your left hand's going to come down and your right hand's going to go up, okay? So you've gone from here, working in opposite directions of one. Try that again. So you're thinking, Right hand straight, push it straight to the ceiling, left hand squeezing that elbow down, okay? Squeezing the elbow down here, pushing up with this one, push. Good, that's three out of eight. Okay, try and put it together. One, two, three, good, a little bit faster. And one, two, three. Don't worry if you're finding this really challenging, you're looking at me going, got no idea what I'm doing. Okay, that is normal, this is challenging. It's all about working the brain. It's doing the same type of um, brain training exercises that you'll find in puzzles, codes, word searches, crosswords, it's the same type of brain training. All right, so we're gonna go, one, two, three. Again, the right hand's gonna come down as the left hand pushes up on four. We're going to make a big L shape. So you go from here, one hand comes down, one hand comes up. Good, there's your four. They're the hardest four, okay? The next four are easier. So you go one, two, three, four. That was a bit fast, let me go again slower. One, so think they're doing opposite things. One's going, squishing in, the other one's coming in. The one's going up, the other one's coming in. The one's going up, the other one's coming down. From there, we're just gonna do four more moves, which is open, easy, in, easy, swish, easy, drop, easy. So last four, five. So last four, just go open, in, squish, drop. Try that again. Open, in, squish, drop. One more, you should be able to do that one. Open, in, squish, drop. One more, open, in, squish, drop, faster. Open, in, squish, drop, faster. Open, in, squish, drop, okay, too fast. So let's go again from the beginning. See if you can remember the very first arm position and put your arm there now. Hopefully you've got it and it was this one. Move into the second position, both arms going at the same time if you can. Have you got it? It's this one. Again, move into position number three, see if you can do it. Think about where your arms are going to go. This one. Well done if you've got it. The next one, what do we do? Hands go in opposite direction, so the one goes up, the one goes down. And the last four easy ones, open, in, squish, drop. All right? Now we put it together. Are you ready? Have a little go. You can try this with music at home. You can just try and do it slower. You can play and rewind it. But maybe it's something you do a couple times a week just to get your brain flowing. And I have um, hundreds of these combination exercises that are great for coordination, balance, um, using your memory, all right? Great little exercises. So you've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Keep going. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Are you with me? Don't worry if you're not. You can always go again. Let's try one more time. And one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Your task now is to do it as fast as you can. Are you ready? Go. 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 Is that too fast? I'm proud of myself for that one, okay? Another task. 
Okay, and I'm going to give you time to pause the video and think about this, no rushing ahead. I want you to do everything again on the other side. So you've just done this. I want you to work it out so you would start here. Okay, so get your hands in this position, pause the video, and try and work it out. Off you go. Okay, did you get it? It looks like this. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I'll go a little bit slower. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Then have a play, have a play with it in your own time. You can do one side, other side. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I'm just showing off now. Good, well done. All right, guys, take your time with it. I know it's challenging, and I know you might have given up ages ago and might not even get to this part of the video. But if you have, well done.